This method can help answer key questions in the nanomaterials field, such as DNA nanotechnology, nanomolecular circuits, and nanomedicine. The main advantage of this technique is that it dramatically increases the capability of controlling periodically arrayed elements in both two and three dimensions. To begin, download and install CAD Nano software to design a DNA accordion rack. Open CAD Nano and click the square tool to add a new part with a square lattice. Click the pencil tool and draw each beam on the right edit panel of CAD Nano. Break beams every 32 base pairs for joints between adjacent beams. Place staple crossovers in the same position as the joints. Use the Insert tool and the Pencil tool in CAD Nano to let the joints have additional single-stranded crossovers. Now, click the Break tool. Break the strands where staple strands are circular or longer than 60 base pairs. To design the DNA lock strands, click the Break tool. Break 8 base pairs of a staple DNA region to make a sticky part and delete 8 base pairs of a staple DNA region. There are 18 sticky parts in the 6x6 accordion rack. Place sequences that are reverse complementary to the sticky parts at both ends of lock strands and connect them by a bridging region, which consists of poly T strands of the desired length. For the reconfiguration, add 8 base pairs of toehold sequences at the end of the DNA locks for strand displacement. Design strands.